Ooh, the healing basket, huh? Wine weave basket. What do we want here? We have really cheap stuff. I mean, I, I have to buy all the cheap stuff, right? I mean, come on now. Man, we have this fanny pack as well. I'm kind of crazy. I can go for a shovel right off the get-go. But this is not bad at all. And everything is on sale, so I'm actually really strong. I think I roll. Wow. Wow. This is straight up dumb. I mean, this is straight up dumb. Have I ever been this strong right off the get-go? I feel like I haven't. I feel like I really haven't been this strong right off the get-go, man. Oops. Let's do something like this, then. Uh, I don't think we br even bring this. We have no, st we have not enough stamina, right? And then I think we bring this. Ooh, there we go, guys. Right off the get-go, generating econ. I mean, this guy, there's no way I would lose. No way we lose there. Should be quite easy. There we go. Um, what do we want next? I mean, I'll take some space. I'll take some space. Do I take a whetstone? Not for the full price, I think. I could get another shovel. <laughs> and just double shovel it. What do we think about that? Tusk poker as well. An early tusk poker is pretty strong, right? Double shoveling it up or going for the early tusk poker. I think early tusk poker and then I lock this. We want to go for healing, right? We need healing because the vine weaver's basket increases all my healing by 10% plus 3% per slot filled with the nature item. So that's going to be really strong, right? Uh, I don't think I reserve this. I just go next. I just take my good early game here and I just see what I can cook later. If we get a recombobulator, we can just recombobulate everything and we'll see what happens, right? Should be cool. Not too bad. Oh, this guy is pretty strong as well, though. I applied a lot of uh, blind swing, though. I think we can win. Ah, he healed. Ah, frick, man. Okay, unfortunate. We have another blind item. Hmm. I'm gonna buy the space. Do I need another banana? The banana is good, though. It heals, right? So it works well with the vine weaver's basket. This is also good. Herbs are good. Works well with the vine weaver's basket. I am think I'm gonna sell this and buy the herbs. That's my, that's my final decision. It's my final decision, ladies and gentlemen. Um, this is also a nature item. So I kind of want to get that in there as well. Kind of want to get that over there as well. Alright, that looks good. I could get this. Like, it's like 5 bonus health or something. No, 2 bonus health. Whatever, man. It's fine, right? It's just 2 bonus health. I don't think that's worth. Alright, let's go. We're getting the extra econ. Remember, we're not that strong. Well, we're pretty strong, actually. We're pretty strong with extra econ. Right? Because we have the shovel generating 1 gold. This generates 1 gold. And we have the early tusk poker, which is not even that bad. 50% chance to gain 1 spike. We get a spike there. Not bad at all. Alright, come on. He has a lot of healing, but that's about it. With the Groovert. We should be fine, though. And he has some lifesteal on this as well. Okay, cool. Garlic. Stinky wall. That's not bad. Garlic gains plus 5 armor. Gain 3 armor every 4 seconds. That's actually crazy. And we get poison, but then we have to go for a poison build. How do we go for a poison build? Piggy Piñata is kind of crazy. Shop enter, piggy banks have... Ah, uh, actually Piggy Piñata is too cool. I'll take this. I'll take this. I think they reworked this recently as well. 
This is not bad because of the wine beaver's basket, but it's a little bit too expensive right now. I'm gonna get the space. Okay, I just need to buy every single piggy bank known to mankind. Three gold. Do I buy anything else? Do I need a dagger? No. Do I need another one of these? No. Do I need a mana orb? Not yet. I think I'm just gonna roll one more time. There's a banana on sale, which isn't bad. There's a acorn collar, which does nothing here. This thing could be good for later. Do I want to sell anything to get it? Hmm... I could sell a garlic, but at the end of the day, the banana is kind of nice. Do I just buy the banana and then just play her next turn? The thing is, I have so much stamina already. Do I really need another banana? Not really. Do I want to sell a garlic for this guy? Oh, it's not even enough. I think I just lock this and I go next. Because like the garlic, th this could be nice, right? This could be good. Oh, he has only one banana and the... Pff, okay, buddy. We're gonna try a little bit harder, but he does have a lot of healing. Wow, so many healing things. Wow, he has infinite healing. I don't know if he, uh... I don't know if he, uh... Oh, frick. Oh, I don't know if I can get him. Oh, I have so many tusks, though. Ah, oh, he looks so weak. But he just has so much healing. My piggy bank did not break. We have a Hungry Blade, which is really good. We have some healing, and this is gonna be really good with the Wine Weaver. Okay, this is good. So we are gonna pivot into, into Hungry Blade. And then we have the Tusk Poker as well, so that is very good. Do we want this little Goobert? A Vampirism Goobert would be nice at some point, but do I buy it for full price? I'm gonna say no to that. What do we sell then? I think we sell the Shovel then. I think it's time to sell that Shovel. And then I think this goes here. I mean, Goobert is nice with the healing thing, though. Hmm. But which Goobert would I build? That's the question. I don't have any space. It's the other problem. I don't have any space, guys. I don't think I buy the Goobert. I think I lock it and go next. I have three lives left. It's fine. <laughs> Okay, come on, this guy, there's no way, man. He doesn't even have the thing in the duffel bag. There's no way I would lose against this guy. Okay, we have some vampirism, it's not bad. There we go, it broke and it gives me so much. The piggy bank just gave me infinite. What the freak is this? I need space, recombobulator, interesting. Not really interesting though, is it? The piggy bank just gave me infinite stuff, bro. Let's do this. And then put the put the guy over here. Put the fries in the bag, bro. like this okay something like this and then we have some good goober triggers we have a lot of nature items in the thing and then we don't have this in the thing but that's okay and then we don't have space so i gotta roll for space right <laughs> hammer to break the piggies <sighs> do i sack one round to buy hammer and break the piggies i don't think it's worth i think they will just break eventually right i don't have space for the piggies man i mean these are not bad they give me empower as well gain a lock they're not that good though. And then this is stamina, so I want that. I think I just buy this and I just put the piggies in. And we just call it day. Like they will just break by 
you know. They will just break. By being piggies, they will just break, right? By having this. I think this is fine. I don't think I go for the hammer because I, the hammer does nothing for the rest of my build. Right? So I think we're fine. And then we will play flute eventually. Like, they have a 30% chance to break. I'm sure they will break. One already broke. This is insane, by the way. This is probably the coolest skill to get. Piggy Piñata. I think I should win, right? Like, he just doesn't have damage. All his food is away from his pen. He just shouldn't have damage. He's removing my lifesteal, though. Why is he so strong? I was really close, even though I have so many spikes, man. I could buy this to get spikes, so my things didn't break. Hmm. My things didn't break, guys. Hmm. That is not very bueno, is it? This is way too greedy. More space, more piggies. Okay. Is this the best I can do? This is probably better. Oh, it's not bad. Now I have a lot of empty space, which is a little bit stupid. Do I go for Carrot Goober? No, I, I think I only go for Blood Goober. Do I sell anything? I could sell a Garlic to bring the Piggy Bank. I could sell this to bring the Piggy Bank, but I, uh, I lose combat power. I don't think I want to lose combat power. It's three gold. Can't really sell anything, can I? Alright, let's go! GG! He's building a carrot goober. He has like no triggers on the goober. Well, he does, but it's like not that ideal, right? Like, come on. Surely we win this? I think I win this very easily as well. Should be quite easy. Come on. Come on. He's running out of stamina as well. I'm never running out of stamina. I need actually more weapons. I have too much stamina. I need another weapon here to make myself way stronger. Uh, now the question is, what do we want? <clears throat> Spikes gained inflict two poison. That is not bad. This one gives me a bunch of a uh, bunch of regeneration, which is good. Heal for thirty and place two debuffs. I think this one is the best. I think that is the best. I will buy space. <laughs> now it's getting silly. Now it's getting silly! I'm missing one activation. I do this. Missing one activation. If I can put something here. A nature item. Which is gonna be this here. Okay. Oh, I'm missing two activations, sorry. Missing two activations. Can I go better than that? It's weird with the with the basket positioning. I think it's worth, isn't it? Isn't it worth? Nah, it's actually not worth. Hmm. This is a nature item. This is a nature item. I think this is fine. I think this is fine, guys. This is fine. And then what do we do with this? Do we get another Tusk Poker? I mean, we could make a shield. It's 
spike shield, it's not that bad. I could get another blueberry, which works well with mana. 5 mana used, heal for 13. And then I just lock this. Okay, I mean, I get more things, but my blueberries are slower, but I feel like it's worth, right? Because regeneration is way better. Regeneration is my best stat, right? All right, let's go. Four lives left. It's not bad. Uh, this doesn't seem that strong, but he's going to apply a lot of blinds to me. And, oh, he does have the little, the little knuckles. He's going to stun me as well. Oh. He applied frost to me as well twice in a row. Oh freak, I'm getting RNG'd guys. Getting big time RNG'd. I need a new weapon. He's running out. This is fine. I have a lot of vampirism, so my weapon now does a lot of damage, guys. Lots of damage. That's very good. We need to find the the spot the thorn the thorn whip. That's what we really need here. I think this is insane. I think I need to go double, double, double this. What the frick just happened, bro? Uh, can I play this? No, right? This crease your stamina usage. But it's a hefty seven gold. I mean, this, this, this skill is insane. This is the best thing in the game now, I think. I have a lamp, which isn't even that bad. Use seven armor, which I get from the thing and from the flute. And then use a seven lock, which is kind of hard to get. Seven spikes, I don't even want to use them. I have 8 gold left, I could buy this, but I think I just roll. The Blood Gooby. I think we sell the lamp, right? We just buy the go Gooby. We get the Gooby, guys. The Gooby! Oh yeah, that would have been better positioning last turn as well, by the way. Blood Goobert. Ah, uh, this game is so fun, guys. Look at it. Now I'm just popping off. Just look at it, man. I'm just gonna pop the frick off now. I'll be so strong. I'll be so freaking strong. Oh, frick. Frickity frick frack. Lucky pig, you know. Uh, I think I'm going for the next Gooby as well. I'm gonna keep it a buck, guys. I think it's another gooby angle. Alright, cool. Am I not really strong? To touch the both blueberries. Yeah, yeah, you were right. I, I miss... I saw it. Saw it. He has five mushrooms, man. The poison is gonna stack up so fast. But that's all he has. And he has spikes. The thing is, I have a lot of lifesteal and I do a lot of damage with these two swords. The thing is, I need double Bloodthorn because this is 3 to 17 damage because it only goes up by maximum damage goes up. Whereas the Bloodthorn goes up by one full damage, so minimum and maximum damage. So it wouldn't be 3 to 17, it would be 15 to 17 or whatever the base low thing is. I mean, 40, 40 poison is too much, guys. I think we're dead. He's healing too much. He's actually insane. He's healing so much from this. Heal 20. Ah, uh, he's actually crazy, bro. He, he cooked. The blood gooby will be good though. Okay, it's not a hardwood. Have more slots. Items affected by use minus eight stamina. I think it's just this. This just heals me. 40% of your maximum health. This is just a free heal, right? Free heal, it's not bad. Do I even need this? Okay, so the blood goobird. Gain two. Six item activations, steal 10 life, increase by one for each vampirism. 
So that's gonna be freaking amazing. We need more regeneration. Uh, we need more regeneration now. So we need to position this a little bit better, in my opinion. We will probably center this or something. Yes. And then we will move everything to the... To the left. And then we can center this bad boy. And then we can put stuff. That's about it. And then we can put stuff over here. So here has to be a blueberry. This is gonna go like this. There we go. Oh, frick. Ah! Uh, how do we do this? Do I have more garlic? No. I think the food value doesn't matter that much. The food value doesn't matter that much. Food not as important here. Because I have so much stamina and everything, anyway. Do I have another nature item? Okay, we have full activations on this thing. Uh, we could go for the health potion, but it's gonna kill this. It's not worth, right? It ain't worth. I could go for another flute, but again, like, what's the point? I mean, I can buy it because it's on sale. Okay. So now we want to roll first and see what happens. I don't think I need this. Huh. Fantastic. Okay. And then I have this as well. Okay, that is fantastic. That is truly fantastic. Okay, now the question is how do we get that pineapple as activated as possible? I guess it just goes here. I would like more juice on the pineapple though. Honestly, the spikes don't even matter that much right now. Spikes don't really matter that much right now. Something like this. <coughs> and then we do this. And then we do this. Yes, sir. And then how much percentage is this guy getting? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I'm only missing two slots. That's also good. That's good. That's good. Okay, this positioning stays the entire game. This positioning at the bottom stays the entire game. It's very good. And then honestly, the flute doesn't matter that much. Flute doesn't matter. This guy can go down here. This guy doesn't matter much. Doesn't matter much. And then you just go here. And then I don't think we ever need this. And this would be nice though. I do get mana now. Yeah, this would be nice. And then the flute just doesn't matter. I could even kick both flutes. Nah, I need I need one flute, I think. I have a lot of stamina usage now. Okay, I, I guys, if I don't get the thorn whip, I'm just dead, right? Oh, he's very greedy with the pigs as well. And he has a bunch of attack speed. It, I don't know, man. Does this seem strong to you? It doesn't seem insane to me. I feel like we can make it work. And he only has one dagger. I think we can win this. And we will re revive from Power of the Moon once. And he has a lot of melee weapons and we have spikes. Ah, he's getting Shrek, bro. It's not even close. Look, we have 12 vampirism now. We have so much healing. And the Gooby just steals life every time. 18. Nah, it's actually crazy. Wow, cool. Oh, a skull badge is sick. But it's a little bit too late, isn't it? What can we do with a skull badge? This mother trucker just gave me trumpets. Amulet of energy. The item triggers 100% faster. Hmm. Nah. 
buff use. Refund 25% of the fuse buffs. Alright, so I definitely buy this. Do I buy... Do I buy... The skull badge? The thing is, Staff of Unhealing, but it's too late now, right guys? It's too late to make a Staff of Unhealing. I need to find a broom and all of that trash. With the Vine Weaver Basket, that's a really good combo. Strong Vampiric Potion is kind of sick though. Nah, I don't give a frick. I'm not buying that badge. Uh, I don't think I'm buying... Volpertinger? I don't think I'm making a lightsaber goobert either. Or am I? Am I making a lightsaber goobert? What does it do again? It's been a long time since I made one. Uh, heal for 20 and inflict, inflict 6 for 3 seconds. I feel like we just want Omnivamp Goobert, right? I think we just want the Omnivamp Goobert. Am I buying this? No. I don't think so. Every 3 seconds gain 1. This is obviously very good. Wait, what does the Cursed Heart do again? I can make a Cursed Heart. What does that do? What does the Cursed Heart do? Where is that sucker? Where are you at, buddy? Does anyone see the Cursed Heart, guys? Where is the Cursed Heart? I can't even find a heart container. Oh, there it is. Uh, Heart of Darkness, every four seconds, steal two buffs, prioritizing regeneration. Triggers 20% faster for each dark item. And U7, gain 90 maximum health, 4 in power, and your opponent's healing is reduced by 40% for once. Whoo! But... He doesn't generate regeneration. The normal hunt container, I think it's still good to build. The thing is, it's never gonna even reach, um, the thing. Oh wait, guys, guys, does anyone know if, if he has to use 7 regeneration or does, like, does he use 7 or do I have to use 7 with other ways and then he procs? Does anyone know how it works? Or does he have to use 7 regeneration? I mean, I buy this either way, man. Randomly gain 1 or gain 3 and remove 2 from opponent or 1 to summon up from opponent. I don't think I want this. No one knows. Sag. I mean, I think I make a Heart of Darkness though, man. Pretty sure it's sick. And then I don't think I need a Stone Skin Potion. I don't need these. I can buy this. I can put the, the freaking thingy here. And then this guy is kind of nice as well. I'm just gonna make him trigger faster because that is gonna give me more regeneration and more regeneration equals more damage and you know, we win the game for free. For free, by the way. Look at this optimization, guys. There we go. Now we have even more uh, juicers. Cool. Now we're just missing one juicer activation. Okay, very good. And then we have no flutes. No, we have one flute. <laughs> we have three flutes. Okay, hopefully I get some more piggies. I popped like six piggies this game. That was insane. It uses. Okay, thank you, sir. Oh, this guy is like, bro, you're, you're half your thing is empty, bro. Half your thing is empty, man. He has two revivals, but like, if you don't have any heat, you're freaking dead. Also, I'm stealing your heat. Oh no, I'm not stealing it yet. Oh wait, also he worked. Oh, because he yoinked. Mm. Guys, do you think that's even good? Do you think playing this item is even good? 
Because at the end of the day, he just stole... What he did is just steal my juicer. He stole my sword's damage, basically. But I mean, he does give me foreign power. And it freaking cocks the entire enemy. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's pretty good, bro. It's good for sure. Are you good? No, right? Not good for me, at least. Okay. Gotta put this guy over here. To make the blood goobert. And then you are super happy. <coughs> Holy frick, brother man. You are giga happy over here. That's fantastic. I don't think I need anything. Yeah, I think I just go. I mean, yeah, I just go. I mean, I could make some blood shield, uh, some blood arm, uh, some moon armor and stuff. I could make some moon armor and all of that stuff. Do I really need another food? It's not really. Okay, I need thorn mails, guys. Uh, thorn, thorn, uh, thorn whips, thorn sword, whatever it's called. Blood thorn is what it's called. We need double dot that, and we just win the game for free. We cannot lose. It's impossible to lose a single fight. I think if we have all of this, this is absolutely crazy. Double blood Uber as well. It's crazy. And vampirism, but well, that's fine. We're stealing their buffs. Easy peasy. I don't give a freak about this. I could make a blo uh, a thingy. It offers me another skull badge, bro. You gotta be kidding. You gotta be freaking kidding. There we go. Moon armor. What does it do? Gain 50 plus 20 for each magic item. Every 2.6 seconds gain and reflect two debuffs. Okay, so we gain mana. Do we want to gain mana? It's okay, but what does this do, Exal? Ah, uh, moon shield, moon armor activates inflict one blindness. It's not that bad either. But it's 13 gold. I really don't have any space for it, do I? I don't have any space whatsoever, guys, for this mother trucker. 13 gold as well. It's crazy. I mean, what else do I buy? I just roll. Moon shield or moon armor? Which one's more useful? Gain one on attack, chance to prevent 12 damage and remove stamina. Items gained 12 armor, gain one mana. I don't really have anything to do with mana right now though. But the mana orbs are gonna give me 17 random buffs eventually. I mean, I'm not gonna be able to stack that much mana. I feel like I just keep this for the 40% health heal, and that's about it. It's too expensive to buy this. I think I buy this. Another Goobird? Pretty, <laughs> let's have some fun. Oh, this is really good. I don't think I need more of these. Uh, okay. <clears throat> So I don't think we change this Goober. This Goober stays like this. Then this Goober is also pretty happy. He's pretty happy. Now the last Goober is not happy at all. And then this attack speed can go on this guy. This guy is every 4 seconds. This guy is every 1.7 seconds. This is good. Uh, this is good. Honestly, I can just put this here. But I mean, I, I do get more often attacked, right? But it's only 30% chance. And then I can put this over here. And then I can put another Goobert here. Somehow. And then, I don't know, do I even need this? Not really. I could make a mana thirst. Oh, I could go mana with the, with the moon armor and stuff. But I don't think that's worth. I mean, this Goobert is just sad, right? He's just gonna be sad. That's just gonna be a sad goober, guys. This is kind of trash, but whatever, bro. This is just a sad old goober. That's okay. Go next. 
Oh yeah, we go triple blood goobered. Look, this guy is it has my two thorn thorn uh, whips, and I have the two blood blades thingies. Do you play against the real players in this? Yes, it's asynchronous matchmaking. You play against the ghost of real players. All right. Oh, this is really good, huh? This is so freaking good. Just make everything faster. Question is, where do I position it, though? I mean, this is good, but it's too expensive. Where do I position this? I can't really position this well. Oh, this guy is worthless. This is not even that bad. Another crown is actually good. Fanny pack. I don't really need fanny pack, but it completes my backpack, sure. I don't really need Volpertinger. Huh. I'm getting some trash freaking items, guys. Also, I have a lot of vamp vampiric items, but how do I position this properly? It's also impossible, right? Low key. Ay, 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 na, 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 na. This is good though. But it has to be positioned well. I feel like it's good though. to go here anyway um how do we position this i mean it's not bad it's not bad here it's not hitting my armor though and my weapons i feel like this is too important this region region is the most important stat i have right now i will lose all my damage if i don't have the maxed out region with this uh, i need to max out my healing as well with the Vine Weaver's Basket. So I think these are must-haves. And then I can't really fit like this, so yeah. So this is just like this, and this guy's just speeding up all the Goober triggers, which is good. It's also speeding up this, which is fine. And then... This guy could also get sped up, but he loses too much. And then this guy would ideally get sped up, huh? I'm losing too many goober triggers, though. I'm losing too many goober triggers, guys. With this right there. Could do something like this that screws the, the 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 flute though i think this is good as well oh it's so complicated no how do i position this i have to change everything then do we want to do that i'll let twitch chat decide do we want to do a puzzle for the next 15 minutes <laughs> do we want to do that guys the reorganization is gonna take 15 minutes, I promise you. But it's gonna be much stronger then. It's gonna be so complicated. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go one fight without it, and then I'm gonna go... I'm gonna buy it. Because, like, it's gonna give us so much vampirism. So much. Oh, frick, my stamina might actually run into troubles here. <sighs> My stamina is dead. Dead in the water. What is this trash, man? Let me have some fun, you place of garbage. You know what? The goobers are stealing everything, though. The goobers are stealing life. I'm still dealing damage to him. With the goobers, yeah? And Moon, Moon heals me. Ha, <laughs> goobers kill. Lol. Get Shrek, baby boy. Okay, I need to redo literally everything. 
Ooh, that's gonna be annoying as frick. That is gonna be annoying as frick, guys. Okay. So let's check this out. Uber here. Uber here. Uber here. Okay. Penny pack here. All right, Goober Goober. Goober Goobert. Three. Cannot get four unless we compromise the Goobert. Four would be one more vampirism though. But we're compromising the Goobert to trigger less often because the weapons are the biggest triggers. Or the fastest triggers. So I think that is not worth. And then how do we maximize this? This has to be maximized. Maybe it is worth to 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 grief the goober because that allows me to maximize this more. Maybe it is worth to grief the goober a little bit. Because now I can do this, and then I have four, and that does seem quite fantastic, doesn't it? So now I have four here. So I grief this goober, that's okay. Then we put this here, we put this over here. How do we do this? How do we, where can we put this where all the things can be triggered? We're missing one activation. Is that okay for us? Is missing one activation okay? Missing one regeneration. Is that okay? Yes. I would say that's the only way we can do it, right? That is the only way we can do it, right? Okay. But that's a lot of, like, it's also every 8 seconds gain one of every type of buff. Like, it's, it's a pretty big deal. It's a pretty freak freaking deal, right? This item. Let me just keep rolling first as well. Let's see what we get. There we go. That's what I was thinking. Like, what if I get this, right? Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, so we did get that. So now we can get rid of some things. What do we not need? What do we not need? So, first of all, what about this guy right here? On the weapons and on a bunch of food. That seems good to me. Okay. What do we not need? So obviously we need to play this to craft it. So one turn, we will be screwed a little bit. So this turn, we will be a little bit screwed up. So that's okay. I, I guess I just throw one turn. What do we sell? We are selling, I think, the piñata. We make a Bloodthorn. We make a Bloodthorn and we just surrender this fight. What do we think? Instead of making my backpack now, this is going to combine anything. I'm just going to surrender this fight. That's okay. I'm just going to surrender this fight to not cause headache to us. It's just not going to be fun to make my backpack now and then make it again with a completely different uh, size, you know? There we go. I'm going to roll again.
I think I'm gonna buy this. Start of battle, gain 25. Items gain 35 armor. I'm not really gaining a lot of armor. So I'm just gonna sell this. Okay. That's really good. Your healing is increased. That is very good. Another pineapple is not bad. Okay, so now the question is, what else do we do? How else do we position this? So, we are gonna put some bananas. Let us see how we put the bananas. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. So a garlic is in the juicer. The garlic could also be like this. And then there can be another little guy. And then little guy here. But, remember, the blueberries are actually amazing triggers for the dude. So I think that's what we'll do. Also, I need some more uh, value on this guy. Okay. Like this, maybe? I like this. You can go here. And this guy has full nature items, right? Yep, all the nature items in the wine beaver's basket. Very good. So now we want some activations on this. On these boobers. Four seconds, that's a really good activation, actually. This goober is a little bit gimped, but it's fine. So this goober, where does this goober go? Just here, it's not bad. I'm kind of cooking, though. I'm kind of cooking. And then I don't have space for this. Is that okay? This goober is a little bit of a failure, isn't he? And this guy triggers faster at the start. <sighs> it's fine. Who else triggers faster at the start? I think this guy. Every four seconds, steal two buffs. It's kind of good. I, I could also go for this guy. Maybe this guy, actually. Ramp up, ramp up at early game. I think this Cooper just needs to be sold. Mm. Does this Goober need to be sold? I think... A holy item increases your healing. Ah! Yeah, for sure then. Oh! Very good. And then this is just unique. This goes wherever. This guy doesn't really seem useful. I mean, I don't have space, right? I don't have that much space. This is definitely better. Like, getting attack speed is really good, no? Is it better than the, the shield? Four spikes, four damage. I think it is. Oh, yeah. We need another thorn whip? I think now we're giga strong. Like I'm giga strong, bro. I just got so much stronger, no? With this thorn, thorn, uh, blood thorn. Just look at this blood thorn. 27 to 31 damage, 29 to 33. And I'm healing on all of that, bro. 
I'm just stealing all his vampirism as well. Look, this guy is just yoinking his vampirism. And the blood goobers are just going crazy. Just look at it. Look. Just look at this, man. It's absolutely crazy, bro. My spike damage is also insane. Nah, guys. We win those. Wow! Another blood goobered! Another freaking blood goobered, man! Okay, I mean... Now... It's for sure ditch the thing, right? Increase your healing by 4% only. It's not that big of a deal, right? I would rather have better Goobert activators, which are here in this corner. It's way better to have the Goobert down here, right? With the Blueberry, the Prismatic Orb, and I have to have the Blood Goobert here. So I'm gonna get another Vampirism item. Wow, man, just Giga Goobert. Um, I mean, this is not even that bad. It's not really needed, though. Another crown is good as frick. I think it's time to get rid of this then. Because this is for sure better. Is this better or the, the, the heart container? I feel like the heart container is better, right? And then another crown. And then the spike, the, the pineapple is also nice. The pineapple would also be nice, not gonna lie, but I only have one bloodthorn. I have too many good items, guys. I have too much good stuff. I think this one is kind of trash. Amulet of energy here is not really needed. I could make some room. Like, this guy is not needed. But, like, where do I fit this, right? It's kind of hard. It's kind of hard to make the room that I need here. Who is he talking to? I don't know, man. No one, I guess. You mother trucker, man. Survive two rounds. <laughs> I mean, it's the last round. Like, I can only combine one more time. Okay, cool. Okay. Oh, frick. Stinky cheese and double axe with execute. But we do have invulnerability twice, by the way. We're invulnerable for half the fight. Look, he's almost dead already. And I was invulnerable for the entire time. And I'm stealing his buffs. I'm stealing his regen. So I just keep getting more vampirism. He's dealing 70 damage though, but I have so much lifesteal, man. Ah, bro, this is so crazy strong. Bro, like, come on, man. Like, why doesn't it prioritize? I messed it up. I messed it up, guys. Let me go back. Go freak yourself, man! Go freak yourself, man! Oh man, I messed it up, guys. I don't have a blood goober. I have another blood amulet. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is just not gonna be used. I can get another crown. One gold. I have to sell something for one. Sell this attack- why is this attack speed gem even there? What the freak am I doing, bro? Okay, I mean, I have three crowns. And then where does the blood amulet go? Where does the blood amulet go, guys? That is the big question. Okay, I mean, it's just this, right? It's just this. I'm gaining additional vampirism. I mean, I win the game, no? Bye bye, Cooper. And then I can just get this as well for easy spice. Whatever, man. It's not even that bad. Okay. GG. Just look at this, bro. Holy freak. Prismatic Orb. Giga Omnibamp. We didn't even find Thornmail. And I still win the game. Man, I could have had Triple Goobert. I'm so dumb, man. I'm such a dumbass, man. I forgot to juice it. Well, I mean, is it my fault, man? Why is it trying to combine into Rainbow Goobert when I have only two Gooberts? Like, you should probably try to combine with the thing you can, actually, you freaking moron Goobert. You freaking mother trucker, man. You mother trucker. 
He has 50, 50 poison on me. And he's removing all my buffs. My buffs are dead. I have 6 vamp. I'm pretty sure he's gonna kill me. Fatigue damage. But, Loki, I have invulnerability. Nice. Okay, I had enough invulnerability. 109 poison, I still won. Hope you enjoyed. Subscribe.